is good man okay too okay how your mum go and today we are doing a review on that thing so so it's the rapid gt i don't know rapid gt topless this thing is known for being a drift car and because its wheel spin is just no traction control however it's beautiful initiating system one System one loaded. Hey guys, it's Hackerman OK2 here. And I've I've just hacked into Goodman OK2. And car show on a budget for the episode Oh fuck. For this episode is mine. And there is nothing you can do or say about it. Now, what was that car I was gonna review? Who even cares? It's trash anyway. The real car that we all know everybody wants to fucking get is actually... Hello? This is the police. A anyone with a photo, please pull over. Um, now if you don't, I will have to arrest you. I am more important than all of you, and I am trying to do something with my life. But you are making it take a very, oh hello, a very long time, longer than it should have to. And quite frankly, it is depressing. Actually, hold on. We need some privacy, baby. All right, all right. You want to suck a fuck or hand job? I would like to suck fuck, please. You can take my money. Dirty. Oh well, hello there. And I just imagined that. I honestly, like, why do you do it? Why do you do what you do? Like, honestly, surely you've got something better to do with your life than fuck sucking hand. Like, seriously, being dead honest with you right now, your job seems like one of the most scariest jobs in the world. You just meet up with random strangers and you, you just fuck them. That's this, huh? Oh! Hey, get off my gear stick! And you didn't listen to me. And then you touched my gear stick. Alright, so now that we've done the how much does it get you laid test, now it's time for the how does it do against crashing beach, par beach parties test. Alright, let's see. So, I think we hit two people just then. Oh, they're not scared there? Okay. So, now... I'd say overall this car is pretty good. I mean, it doesn't seem to strike fear into the hearts of people. You ain't getting away from me that easy. Alright, so it does seem to be very, very good at uh, crashing beach parties and getting you fucked. But the, the next question is, how fast does this motherfucker go? So we will start from here, and we will go all the way to here.
So it took 28 seconds to get there. Now that is pretty fucking vast. Especially in this condition, which is amazing by the way, it's an amazing, it's an amazing condition. And if, ever, if anyone tells you otherwise, they're, they're clearly wrong. Alright, look, I'm professional, hence why I'm on the car shop on a budget. And I suppose the last test really is, is to see how indestructible this is. And there's only really one way we're going to find that out today, isn't there? So, if you'll give me a second, I have just the plan. Hello, you're through to Pegasus Lifestyle Management. How can I help? So your specialty vehicle is available for collection right now. We hope you're very happy, sir. Alright, here we are. Now here is the final test for the nice car that is the Rhapsody. Now, is it indestructible? The answer is no. Alright everybody, and that was Hackerman OK2, showing you how the Rhapsody is an amazing car, and that reviewing cars is actually quite hard, and I should leave it to the professionals actually. I might not hack this again, I might hack it again, there's really only one way to find out. And yeah, so I hope you all enjoyed, I'll see you probably fuck knows when I. But anyway, I hope I've convinced you that you should get the Rhapsody over that shitty ass car. Good man, okay, to mention in the beginning. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got places to be, things to do, and good man, okay, too, you can have your channel back. So, basically this car is very good, um, according to those tests it is a very decent vehicle and I highly recommend you buy it for the small price of $420,452 million. Wait what? But that's not a number is it? Shut up, stop believing me, don't be a cunt. A anyways, um, leave a like and subscribe if you like dick for a living, thank you, um, bye. Holy shit, I actually survived that.